What's up everybody, my name is Jeremy Jones and I'm back with another video. Today, we're talking to Yeezy MNBN Metallic. So stay tuned. Hoping one day I'ma get it all right. Brother is engaged, but I start a new life. Yeah, I haven't had a chill day. Really wanna vibe, appreciate the moments. I've been creating, not scrolling. Mom and dad still support it. Alright, man, I'm back with another video, man. Before I get too deep into this video, y'all already know what to do. Go and hit that like button. It really helps the channel out. And if you're new, consider subscribing. I make content about sneakers. Alright, so let's dive in today's video. We're talking the Yeezy 700 MNVN Metallic. Alright man, we're going to be keeping things very simple over here today. We're going to be answering the basic old question. Are they drip or skip? Let's just keep it there. Alright, so first things first, these are set to release December 20th to the best of my knowledge. Coming in at a retail price of $200, right? Okay. Now, of course, I glanced at the resale price and look like they're averaging about $227 and up, depending on the size, right? Okay. Now, this is the MNVN 700, right? Now, we have went back and forth pretty much all this year about what that really stands for. On one side, we stay, we I've heard it stand for modern version, and on the other side of things, I've heard it stand for minivan. I'm gonna go with modern version, but again, it's kind of one of those gray areas that we really just don't understand, but I think majority of us are gonna say it stands for modern version because I guess behind the person who helped design this particular material on the sneaker. Now, speaking of materials, this is supposed to be somewhat water resistant. I don't think it's 100% water proof but water resistance right and these are coming with the infinity laces as well so metallic right it's kind of like that grayish colorway and y'all know me i am a sucker for gray right okay however when it comes to the 700 mmbn i gotta keep it 100 i am not the biggest fan right okay i've heard mixed reviews about the comfort level and all that and some people say they love them some people don't like don't like them it just depends it's kind of one of those it's a 50 50 sneaker and at the end of the day they're all preference at the end of the day right but for the kid they're gonna be a skip now that doesn't mean it's a bad sneaker it's just one of those so much heat has been coming out literally this month alone um from adidas and the easy products man and um this one i just feel like it's not I don't know, it's not just for me compared to all the products that have just been dropping this much. And when I say products, I'm talking sneakers, of course. So much heat has been dropping, and it seems like Adidas, is it just me or is it Adidas and Yeezy have just been hitting us back to back? It's like the minute one drop happens, another drop is right there waiting for us, right? Okay, we literally just had like several drops this week and we got other ones waiting, waiting for us already. So I think they're just trying to get everything done right before Christmas time. And these are coming out on the 20th. So hopefully these will make it there before Christmas time, who knows? And I don't know, the 700 MMBN, they do sell out, but they seem to like not sell out instantly, if that makes sense. Like they're gonna sell out but I feel like they're gonna sit just a little bit compared to say like a 350 V2, right, okay? But these um, 700 MMVN metallics are gonna be a skip for the kid, but I wanna know what you think. I wanna know what you think down in the comment section and will you be going out to these on December 20th, retailing at $200? And of course, let me know if you think they're drip or skip. All right, man, I'm gonna go ahead and get up out of this thing and stop rambling, man. Y'all be sure to hit that like button really helps the channel out and if you're new consider subscribing i make content about sneakers again my name is jeremy jones and thank you for watching and i'm out I figured, uh...